after senatorial elections. Elections Cameroon has to organize municipal, parliamentary and of course presidential elections in the months ahead. But the prevailing crisis in the northwest and southwest regions constitutes a major challenge for the elections management to tackle. It's associate once again. Since the Anglophone crisis took a deadly twist late last year, Elecam officials in the northwest and southwest regions continue to live in fear. The gruesome murder of Eli Roger Chunang, chief of service of the Elecam IT department in Bangem, set a rough stage for Elecam officials with bouts of violent unrest resulting in the destruction of property belonging to the election management body. The latest being the attack on the Elecam Council branch in Guti in the southwest region. Officials from the two English-speaking regions attending a capacity building forum in Douala could not speak to us on camera for fear of being exposed. But a chat with them indicates that most Elecam branches have been abandoned as they run from being targeted by separatist fighters. They also told us voter registration figures have been discouraging. As of the 18th of May 2018, the Northwest region had registered 17,207 persons, while the Southwest could only manage 8,816 persons. As the population continues to shy away from registration, thousands of voters' cards are stocked in polling stations. Council, parliamentary and presidential elections are expected to hold later this year, and the stakes are high since they involve direct universal suffrage. The general director of ELECAM is upbeat that special measures will be taken to guarantee hitch free pools in the hotspots. We can locate, delocate, and relocate pooling stations if the security cannot be assured where the former pooling stations were. To succeed, the participation of all stakeholders is required. We are going to work, not in isolation, we are going to work with the administrative authorities, the political parties, and all the stakeholders to fit our polling stations where the security is assured, the security of human beings, the security of material, the security of the result up till the final result. Presently, ELECAM has registered 6.5 million persons nationwide far from the 10 million potential voters envisaged. The manager of elections, however, did not tell us what would be done to step up the registration process in the tensed regions, despite dishing out second-generation kits Wednesday to the regional delegates of the northwest and southwest regions. It is unlikely that elections will be postponed as the violence escalates, and Elecam officials on the ground say until they see concrete actions from authorities guaranteeing their safety, mobilizing the population and protecting voting materials remain an uphill task.